Good morning, everyone. Glad to have you back today. It's Tuesday, another beautiful Monday for every one of us here. Yeah. Good morning, Lagos. Yes, good morning, Lagos. It's the view is the show that you all love to see very early in the morning. I really appreciate those that have been watching us over the years. So, then I'm starting the headlines this morning is the Nation newspaper. Suspected eight men attack farmer in Undo. Four arrested for rape in Niger. Insecurity in Northeast has raised poverty level, says global body. Ahead Edo 2020, Technical Committee holds crucial meeting in Benin. Ekiti Government, UNICEF partners to end open defecation. And on the Vanguard newspaper this morning, I will fix refineries and fuel import by 2023, says Kiari, the new general managing director of NMPC. Obas, <laughs> that's good because I uploaded this particular story yesterday on social media and someone said, hmm, this is not the first time we are hearing this. <laughs> Moving forward, Obasek is celebrate Omoaka Malik to on elevation as senior advocate of Nigeria. Assault, Abo in court, please not guilty, granted 5 million naira bail. Also, federal government wants South Africa to count for murder of Mrs. Indubisi, Chuku, and lastly, we will fund any concept to impact 10 million Nigerians. Interesting. And for the Punch News headline, North-South educational imbalance threats to Nigerian development. Six Quara institutions get 300 million naira for salaries, reaccreditation. Technology and African transformation. Unilawing chapter of ASU reconciles with national body. Does that mean they'll be joining ASU back? No, just like it's depending on their discussion, what they have on the table, definitely they will, they will know whether they are going to sign join ASU or not. Because, you know, for the fact that they've not been part of us, they've been having a smooth a transition smooth in, their exactly. section, in their education sector. So. And, are, and, and when it comes to the education in Nigeria, they are, number, they are the, let me just say the fastest, mm. because presently they are on break on the second, yes. second semester. Why some are still in school? some are still in school for the second semester section. Mm. Right. But that's all we have for you this morning for the headlines. Don't forget to pick up any of the newspapers to read more stories and then be back shortly for what of Lagos. Don't go anywhere. <music> Concerning this Koza part because he's in line with religion, he's a man of God, he's also a man that practices Christianity. So, definitely, yes. he's going to say, even though he did not even say it directly, he said it indirectly. Yes. So, they want him to say something concerning the Ruga settlement. But for now, boy, it has something to do with politics or politically inclined. So, that is the reason why he decided not to say anything for now. But with this protest, I'm sure he's going to say something. Let's just uh, keep our fingers crossed. Yeah, possibly. And Apostle Sleiman said that they know the kind of church that they will go to, that they wouldn't dare come to his church <laughs> and come and do such. Protestant. And then, well, Idris Abu Karim also replied him back saying that, uh, Dear Apostle Suleiman, are you aware that Lea Sharibo has been under captivity for 501 days? Let me ask you why you did not pray to God when Stimi Otoba accused you. He said you went to the police. Why did you speak up against her and now ask us to be silent while other people are killed, are killed daily? Well, Imagine, okay, before they knew the fact that, okay, if you want to put uh, Pastor Apostle Suleiman and Pastor Adi, we are going to know who the hierarchy stand for first. So that's why they Definitely. decided to go to this thing. But he was saying that, we know Pastor Apostle Suleiman, he can't say anything which is on social media. Yes, so definitely. Yes, yes. But if you want to go to his side, you can also go. <laughs> <laughs> Free word. 
Then also moving forward, congratulations. I have to say that Nollywood is going places, going places because before now we've seen a lot of films going to the International Film Festival, Canada, Toronto, and other film festival. But now Oscars meet three Nigerians who made academic members list. Three Nigerians have made the academic award, popularly known as Oscars, in the newly release of 842 members. The members are Nigeria Today Kilani, iconic veteran filmmaker and storyteller Chinoye Chuku, the first black woman to win the Sudanese Film Festival Biggest Prize for her movie, Clemency, and Adiwale Agbaje, British Nigerian actor who has acted in The Born Identity, Thor, The Dark World, Suicide Squad, and Game of Thrones. Congratulations. Well, Nigerians out there, they are making us proud. So we really appreciate the fact that they are showing the Nigerian part of it. At least I show you Nigeria. And from this thing, we have two from the southwest and one from the southeast. Regardless of that, you are still Nigerian. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so two ex Big Brother Niger lovers will be playing in the romantic, abusive lover movie, The Gifts, which is Teddy and Bam Bam. Well, you know, we all know that. They are going to get married. They are going to get married because <laughs> they are love, this, they are love is something that they are going to get married. Well, um, during the Big Brother reunion show, you did an open proposal to her well, because they asked them a question. If she was the one, and he said yes. So well, what could, what other thing that she wants? <laughs> Imagine, I remember back then the love affair there was basically on uh, miracle and Nina thinking everything's going to go for yes. the after the list. But all of a sudden, I think it was let me say last month towards the end of last month, a miracle uploaded something on social media saying, yes. "Okay, I've been dating this my my girlfriend for the past maybe five years." So people of the opinion, so did you deceive me now to get that thing? Well, it's a game that they play. It's a game. They were both using each other. It wasn't about. One person, one other party was suffering, and the other was miracle was the enjoy for me, and now was enjoy for me miracle. So it's a it's a two way thing. Okay, but I just well, I, I'm, I'm sure they blame everything. Else. Okay, so Bam Bam will be the, one of the lead actors in this movie. The, the gift is the story that was a story of a girl who fell in love with her young teacher and was put in the family way. She survived the trauma of a young single parent with the help of her dad and got into a relationship with an abusive lover. And so, I'm sure that abusive lover is going to live But yeah, he's the abusive lover. Why not? Um, well, uh, oh, <laughs> they are going to act it for real. It's going to yes. be like, what am I going to do? Mm -hmm. We've been doing it behind this load. What is the big deal? Let's just do it. Well, she said okay. it was another ex Big Brother Niger that helped her to get the routine. Told when he was on that helped her to get the group because of her emotional act that wow. she that she would add in the Big Brother house. So she they figured she was going to be the perfect person for the role. And then having a lover to be there, I think wow. it's just going to be a smooth transition. I can't really she's, she's, she's the perfect fit for that particular <laughs> series because I can't even wait to see them because Teddy and Baba they are yes. going to just make it three like this yeah, is yeah exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect combination. <laughs> Alright, so that's all we have for you for the World Top Legal segment. We'll be back shortly. Four point updates. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back from a short break. This is the political update where I'll be telling you everything that's happening in the political scene in Nigeria. River State Governorship Election Tribunal in Port Harcourt has dismissed a petition filed by the African Action Congress AAC governorship candidate in uh, River State in person of Bio Pambo Awara against the Independent National Electoral El Commission, INEC, Governor Yosu Wiki, and the People's Democratic Party, PDP. The tribunal presided over by Justice K. A. Orijapo dismissed the petition on the grounds that it was deemed abandoned on the grounds of Paragraph 4 of the First Schedule of the Electoral Act. According to the tribunal, the petition was deemed to be technically abandoned because the AAC and its candidate failed to meet procedural requirements as to applying for pre-hearing information. Also, moving to Kogi State, 20 aspirants justly for the All Progressive Congress APC in Kogi State governorship election ticket have threatened to work against Governor Yaya Bilo if the Party National Working Committee NWC failed to adopt direct mode of primaries to select the candidates of the party for the November 16 governorship election in 2019 and that's all for political update let's see what the weather is saying don't go anywhere Probability of rain 59%, while humidity stands at 94%. So it's just going to be a bright day, like yesterday. Yesterday, you didn't shower. So today, we are hoping for a nice shower too. 
But the only constant in life is change because anything can happen. <laughs> Before the end of today, change, change, change. Okay, with this, I'm going to say something concerning change because okay. I, we all believe the only constant in life is change. Yes. Moving forward is the greatest thing in Definitely. life. You need to move forward. You need to strive towards excellence. And I'm going to link this to a popular musician signed onto YBL and the Madame Solami Day record label. His name is Picasso. He has decided to leave the record label. Mm. He said, he tweeted this on Twitter. He said, thanks for the support, the platform. I appreciate you endlessly. Thank you deeply. YBN has been a beautiful part of my journey, and I hope you believe me when I say I will never take for granted the blessings you brought to me. Bado, new chapter, seeing the Kazuga moving forward. Mm -hmm. That's good. I think if all. So that means they left on a very good ground. There was no fight. Exactly, exactly something what I want to say now. That means if you are in the record label, sign to a record label. If you want to leave, you can't just decide to leave based on maybe a fight or you know, that. You can leave on which track, consider that. Even yes. after leaving, you can still come first. Please, I need your help. This person is going to tell you, okay, mm. this is how to do yeah, it. True. This is how to do things. It's not that, okay, leaving, saying that he did this to me, he did that to me. Because I, I'm sure last week said something about uh, Ola did saying something concerning his former boss here, Minis. But now this person is living on the mutual concept. Definitely no issue between the mm. both of them. Yes. Moving true. forward is the greatest thing in life. Yeah, definitely. If you feel that you stay in one position would, won't make you great, then move. They say nobody ever make it in their comfort zone. So you need to leave your comfort zone for you to be able to make it in life. Exactly. All right, that's all we have for you today on the platform. Um, please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Follow us on our social media pages at Ibile TV Lagos. Drop your comments on any of our platforms and we want to show you have a wonderful day. Bye for now.